know from studying many, many different people that the people who are very talented usually are so talented because they've used it all of their life. We know that it's a capability that's probably directly associated to a survival mechanism. So the, the very talented people um, 80,000 years ago would have been uh, the number one shamans for tribes. They would know uh, which was the best valley to hunt in for food or which cave not to be in when the cave bear came back. So it's probably psychic functioning that is the reason why we still remain here as a species. It's because thousands of years ago, uh, we didn't possess sufficient information, formal information or educated information to make uh, very good decisions. So psychic functioning uh, provided us with the ability to do that without a lot of information. And, and the, the reason we feel it's this way is because if you go in and actually look for talented, very uh, highly talented individuals, what happens is you find more talent in dangerous jobs like uh, police departments, fire departments, uh, the military. We, we know that also from science, if you were to go to any street corner anywhere in the world, any city anywhere in the world, and randomly pick 200 people off the corner, that one out of the 200 would be a world-class psychic which means that there are a lot of very psychic, very talented psychics in the world. And so people say, well, where are they? Well, they're the, uh, the surgeon that knows automatically what to do in the instant that death is threatening, or the artist that instinctively knows how to paint something in a way that touches people or a uh, detective that closes 85% of his cases. But if, if you were to say to that policeman, I think you close your cases because you're psychic, they would say, no, I just listen to my gut.